does a nigga have to be like super duper macho, alpha male, like stomp down, like ah, uh, to like be a pimp type shit? You know what I'm saying? That's how they, they make it seem like a nigga has to just be super hard about the shit. Nah, well, you, well, you got different. You got different type of pimps. Uh, you gonna see what they got? You got sweet mackers and you know what I'm saying. Sweet no nonsense. <laughs> yeah, no, sweet no nonsense. Yeah. What's a sweet, sweet macker? Because that sounds like something you can I give it like. to him. You know, uh, that that's that's gonna be a nigga who you know what I'm saying gonna use his wordplay to 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 finesse the individual to to do get the mission accomplished. Yeah. You know, then you got your like your no nonsense who. He only gonna tell you once, and then he got a different line of discipline that's gonna make you get the regimen right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And you, you got all kind of different, it's, it, it, like different like dope boys. You know what I'm saying? You got your different type of hustlers to meet the same goal. You know what I'm saying? Not saying that one's better than the other, but the different characteristics in each man that makes him who he is in his ism. Is there anything that's like outdated? Where it's like. In 2022, like niggas not really doing it like this no more, or is it like nah, this shit's what nobody's doing? Well, according to the game, nobody's doing it the original way. That's what a lot of people are mad at. That's what a lot of pimps are mad at because it has it's brought so much heat on pimps mm -hmm. because you do have niggas who who have intervened in this shit and they have fucked it up. They have fucked it up for real ones. You know what I'm saying? You like like how we talking about different types of pimps. You know, everybody knows the the cliche gorilla pimp. You know what I'm saying? Everybody, he's, are you a gorilla pimp? Mm -hmm. And you know, gorilla pimp is man, they exist. Yeah, like and that's what that's what has people. You a pimp, nigga? Yeah. What the fuck? Like you know what I'm saying? That's, that's what, what everybody that's what everybody think. Yeah, like everybody thinks like. Man, stay away from that nigga. Man, he gonna hold me hostage. He gonna beat me up. He go, you know what I'm saying? This nigga finna make me do all kind of shit for his money. You know what I'm saying? And to each his own, you heard it here on Spirit First, man. In 2021, if you put your hands on that young lady because you ran out of words to say, you understand me? You are not the ism. You dig what I'm saying? Not. There's a whole lot of ways out here that you can you can get your point across without having to really be the cliche of what people think this game is. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Because a lot of these individuals that come into this lifestyle, they want a better way. They, they want to do something different. You know what I'm saying? So a lot of times, if you have someone that's willing and wanting to do something, you don't have to be a disciplinarian in order to get your point across because understanding is the first way of guidance. You feel what I'm saying? You got to understand where you're going before you take the direction. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, and that's the main thing with this game that a lot of people get out of the way. When the, net, the black eye to the game is the ones that wasn't really doing it but got labeled as one. You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. The ones that's really out here doing it, hey man, we hands free, hands off. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, the, you, you got, I can't have my fist bowed up to receive some money. You know what I'm saying? So, so the head got to be out yesterday. <laughs> the fence yesterday. <laughs> this way. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Speaking of handouts, so this is something that uh, shit, somebody put me on. Uh, fucking, I actually saw this shit on Twitter. Somebody was in TSF. Um, they explained, they said, there's a difference between a hoe and a whore. Like they, church. Church. Yeah. For real. I, I don't know how true the acronym is. It, it's hoe, like, hand over you everything. You might, you might, you might, yeah. A hoe hands over everything. Hands over everything. You sure. might, you might be, you might see a bitch that know how to sell pussy, but that don't make her a hoe. Come on. A hoe pays a pimp, bottom line. You might, you might have this, this woman that just do this as a hustle. Like, she, you know, every little hood bitch in the trenches going to sell some pussy, going to try it mm. once or twice in their life or every other day or when we got them emergency pussy selling type right. bitches. Like, they just street... <laughs> yeah, they, they, just, they just street bitches that know how to... My rent call, do on the first. My rent do. <laughs> I'm finna hit JJ. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, I, I'm, you know, you got a lot of hoes that do that. Yeah. that and they, it's like, it, it's natural to them because that's just their environment. They just was already... It's our, the hoe is in them. But that don't mean they gamed up. That don't mean they... Because you could take, you could find a bitch on the street that might sell some pussy mm -hmm. and you put a pimp in front of them. I don't need no motherfucking pimp. I don't... I don't, I don't the fuck I need that for? If I'm going to go sell my pussy, I'm going to keep my money. Like, have no understanding to that shit. But you put a real hoe in her face that'll pay, up, that, that pay pimping. Mm -hmm. They're going to look at that bitch like, bitch, you stupid. And you sound stupid. Green. You know Green. what I'm saying? Yeah, for real. Like... It's just it's just an emergency thing for a lot of bitches. It ain't like no career, man. It, it, we when we talk about a hoe, we talking about a bitch like how you said hand over everything. But we talking about a bitch that this is her career. Yeah. 
it's it, she wake up, eat, sleep, breathe this shit. Right. She wake up every day with hoeing on her mind, getting getting that money for that for that man that's in her life. And shout out whoever in TSF told you that, because he told you some real game. He damn sure did. He damn sure did. Yeah, nah, once he told, I, I ain't gonna lie, shit, when, we, when he told me and my homie, man, did all that shit, like, like, I'm, I'm like, in awe, like, wow, that just made so much sense. Like, <laughs> no, said, that's that the shit. acronym. Um, yeah, for mm-hmm. real. Well, so, like, all right, so you saying, like, a chick can just be, like, uh, like, <laughs> How do you know if a chick's like long term or short term, or is it? It's, it's no short term. It's like you either two feet in or like because like you got ten toes or something, right? You know. Oh, you talking about when you get a bitch? Yeah, like cause you said, like the emergency. Like if you chase that, like man, they just like fuck it, I gotta do something. But they might just have like a certain amount that they. Yeah. Now, and that, that, now when I explain that type of bitch, all them type of was not not always bad because you know what I'm saying. You that nigga could come in her life. They right. Gentlemen can come in her life and and you know what I'm saying, really show her and teach her like, hey man, do, do, is this something you really want to do? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because every woman want a man in their life. Yeah. I don't give a damn if you the fucking nigga get money, all that old shit. Like man, them hoes just talking. Every every woman want a man in, in in her life. I don't give a damn if she been ran through since she was in the ninth grade, all the way her all four years of high school to now. She 25 years old. You know what I'm saying? Man, they want a man. They want that. They want that affection. From a man, so you know, see a nigga run into it and really show a right and really give us some game. You know what I'm saying? And you know what, what they call the turnout. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and to touch on what you said though, it, as you get more elevated in, into your your mindset and your game, you know, it's all about who you perceive as acceptable to your standard. You know what I'm saying? A lot of times, you know, that's where the game goes wrong. A lot of people will take. Some women who are opportunists, like you say, I only need it for the right now. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But what happens when sometimes when you get that right now individual, their heart isn't truly aligned like yours. So that's where you end up taking a risk because right. you end up aligning yourself with somebody who only wanted this temporarily where this is your lifestyle. So right. a lot of times you got to cut out the ones that are t- if you if you're going to do a temporary fix, I'm going to let you solve that problem cuz I should be a permanent solution. You know what I'm saying? Right. You, and and that's just how that goes, you know, uh, any 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 person you, that you allow to come in and out of your life, they don't respect the value that you put on your life. Right. And, and that's how you can take put your life at a disadvantage by letting someone temporarily come in and make a permanent statement or a stain on your legacy right and to answer your question you know how do you know when they really 10 toes down for you you might in some pimping get a hold of a bitch you know what i'm saying amongst his program he 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 pretty much know by the first day by the first hour of what this bitch intentions is in his program you know because you got like what what the what the motherfuckers need to understand is, you know, they they, they looking down on this shit, want to lock motherfuckers up. What they what they not understanding, man. A lot of these hoes come to these niggas because they want that they want that that image. They want that fame to say, I pay some pimping, because yeah. it's, it's it's we just gonna be real, even though it's it's hated, but it's 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 really it's glamorized, it's loved. Like man, motherfuckers see this shit and be like. A lot of motherfuckers see this shit and be like, damn, they pimps and hoes. And they smiling and they laughing and, and they like, but in reality, they like, man, them motherfuckers cool. Yeah. They smooth, man. Like, so a lot of hoes, you know, they get a muscle nigga because they want to, you know what I'm saying? They they want to be, they probably were lame in school. You know what I'm saying? They probably right. had no friends. They probably got bullied. Mm-hmm. And, you know, so we just go keep it real, man. This, this game right here. Mm-hmm. It, ex- it it accept a lot of motherfuckers. It, that that what like what 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 bro t- tell me all the time. A lot of motherfuckers failed in the streets, and was nobody's in the streets, and they find this game, <laughs> and and you know what I'm saying they do it right, do everything, and this game accept them. Wow. You know what I'm saying, and it makes them it makes them a street cat now. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Zilla- every other Come Nigga on. done tried Come everything. On. They ended up pimping. Ended up pimping. <laughs> That's crazy. Ended up pimping. That's 